let's get some healing mantra cards for Imbolc 2020. Uh, we're going to do this very simply. I'm going to go Aries through Pisces. I'm going to add some breath work into this to put some spaces in between the mantras so you're free to say each one as we go. Uh, we'll see how it goes, though. We're going to freeform this. Cool, cool. Ground and center. Nice deep breath. Here we go. Angels, gods, goddesses, masters, and the higher selves of all involved. We're going to do these straight through. Aries, through Pisces, one card each. Please guide me, use me. That we may receive the healing mantras that are most truly helpful for us right now. Through the month of February. For a month and a half, if we want to play it that way. Or three months. Wow, until Beltane. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. So uh, here we go. One card for Aries. The name of the mantra, asking for angelic support. Breathe. My angels respond when I am open and authentic about how I feel. My angels respond when I am open and authentic about how I feel. My angels respond when I am open and authentic about how I feel. Aries, breathe. Taurus, sun, moon, rising, please. Yeah, all these are sun, moon, rising. If I didn't say it before, please take what works, leave what doesn't. <laughs> Ground. <laughs> Taurus, sun, moon, rising, please. The mantra, opening my mind, opening my mind, opening my mind. I allow myself to see beyond my beliefs and ideas. I allow myself to see beyond my beliefs and ideas. I allow myself to see beyond my beliefs and ideas, opening my mind. Of course. Gemini, sun, moon, rising. Gemini, sun, moon, rising. Breathe. Gemini, sun, moon, rising. Illuminating the truth. Illuminating the truth. Illuminating the truth. I am willing to see things clearly, no matter the outcome. I am willing to see things clearly, no matter the outcome. I am willing to see things clearly, no matter the outcome. Gemini, breathe. Cancer, all my Cancerians, my Krabby Crabs, underwater breathing. <sighs> Cancer, sun, moon, rising. What's your mantra? Invoking self-realization. Invoking self-realization. Invoking self-realization. Breathe. This one's about breath. Each breath confirms how awake I already am. Each breath confirms how awake I already am. Each breath confirms how awake I already am. Lovely. Uh, Leo? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> yeah, this breath work. I mean, talk about getting high on your own supply. By the way, I haven't paid one cent for any uh, of this breath work stuff I've learned. <laughs> Even the app that I got, I got the free version. I'm just saying, carrying around the Alexandrian libraries in your cell phone, use it. <laughs> nice deep breath. My Leos, my fifth housers, sun, moon, rising. What's your mantra? What's your mantra, my Leo, sun, moon, rising? I'm Leo rising. Uncovering confidence, like we needed that. <laughs> Breathe, uncovering confidence. I am the missing piece that completes the puzzle of the universe. 
I am the missing piece that completes the puzzle of the universe. I am the piece that completes the, I am the missing piece that completes the puzzle of the universe. Ah, oh, blame it on the breath work. <laughs> I'm light headed. A candle in front of me. Gee, what sign is next? It must be Virgo. Nice deep breath. <sighs> Belly breath. <sighs> Virgo, sun, moon, rising. What's our mantra? Ah, grounding my energy. Grounding my energy. Grounding my energy. It is safe to be in the body. It is safe to be in my body, earth signs. It is safe to be in my body. It is safe to be in my body. It is safe to be in my body. Made me burp. <laughs> Libra. Libra, sun, moon, rising. Nice deep breath. Halfway through. I like doing it this way. Always learning. Always growing. Sun, moon, rising. Libra. It's their healing mantra. Exploring unity consciousness. Exploring unity consciousness exploring unity consciousness breath i am one eternal light appearing as all i am one eternal light appearing as all I am one eternal light appearing as all. They just told me we're going to have a lovely closing prayer when we're done with this. Scorpio, uh oh, Scorpio. Nice deep breath. Scorpio, sun, moon, rising. What's their healing mantra? A la Tantra. Overcoming fear. Well, hang on, I admit that's Scorpio. <laughs> I mean, it's a little womp womp, but you know, you're Scorpios. Uh, I transcend every loss. I transcend every loss. I transcend every loss. Oh, it's an interesting symbol on the card. Look, it's the crescent moon it's very mists of avalon we do transcend every loss eventually but remember every loss makes way for new uh for new gain and sometimes we lose shit that we need to lose because it's time and we're glad it's gone uh few things and that would be sagittarius the sagittarius sagittarius here we go nice deep breath Getting so high off this breath work now, I think you get why I'm doing it. <laughs> Saves money. Sagittarius, sun, moon, rising. Sagittarius, sun, moon, rising. What's their healing mantra? Oh, center of the deck. Hmm. Celebrating simplicity. That's something I've never associated with a Sagittarian in my life ever, but celebrating simplicity. Because they're so expansive and Jupiterian. Breathe. I am more fulfilled when there is less to manage and maintain. I am more fulfilled when there is less to manage and maintain. I am more fulfilled when there is less to manage and maintain. Hmm. Oh, I feel the simplicity there. See, these are like spells, and maybe in this context they are. Spells, affirmation, mantra, what have you. 
Capricorn. <laughs> Do you know any Capricorns? Many. <laughs> oh, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising Sun. What? What's their healing mantra? I almost said, what do they need? That's the readings I'm doing after this. What? Capricorn. Sun, moon, rising. Healing mantra. Hearing inner guidance. I love this one. Hearing inner guidance. Hearing inner guidance. Hearing inner guidance. My intuition flows whenever I am still. 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 Good for an earth sign. What's going on in the body? Oh my God, the aquariums. <sighs> Breathe for the air signs. Aquarius, sun, moon, rising, what's their healing mantra? Expanding inner power. Expanding inner power. Doesn't it sound like you're those old-fashioned um, elevators? Third floor, expanding inner power. I should say 11th floor. 11th house, breathe. I am my most powerful when my creativity is given a voice. I am my most powerful when my creativity is given a voice. I am most powerful. I am my most powerful when my creativity is given a voice. Very second chakra. The sacral voice. More! <laughs> <laughs> Give me pie. Last one, Pisces. Oh, here we go. Pisces moon boy that I am. My mer family. Uh, breathe. Breathe underwater, my fishy fishies. Pisces, sun, moon, rising. What is our healing mantra? Polishing my heart. Polishing, not polishing, so there's nothing wrong with it. Polishing my heart. <laughs> Feeling is a power that helps me heal. It's so us. Breathe. Feeling is a power that helps me heal. Feeling is a power that helps me heal. Feeling is a power that helps me heal. Oh, feels good. Just breathe your mantras for a minute. Just breathe. This here comes our uh, our closing prayer, and I'll close this out because I am going to put this uh, the card part on um, on YouTube. Might as well do the whole nine yards, close it with a prayer. Cool, cool. So if you can, get in your body. <laughs> After all that breath work and prayer and lighting a candle and all of that we just did. Cards and whatnot, healing mantras, integrating into the cell tissue and the DNA. Just become aware of your breath. Come back into the now. I'm going to put one hand on my heart and one hand on my second chakra so I can feel the breath in the belly and in the chest. And we'll close this with a bit of a prayer for Imbolc. Dearest God, God us all that is, may our breath be blessed. May we breathe blessings in for ourselves. 
into every cell, breathing blessings into every tissue, breathing blessings into every organ, breathing blessings into every system of our bodies, overflowing into our emotional bodies, every chakra, every synapse, every aspect of the nervous system, every meridian, every energy line in the body. May it be blessed by this breath. May it expand outward into a sphere six feet in diameter around me, given a clockwise spin, picking up in momentum with every breath. Like a turbine of sacred grace, now fueled with my breath, focusing it down into the second chakra and outward into this fear, empowering my energy field now with the blessings of the grace of piety and the grace of mercy. Dearest God, Goddess, all that is, supercharge my energy field with these graces of, pice, of piety and mercy. That all of our one-on-one -on -one interactions, all of our soul contracts may be blessed for the well-being of all. That they may wax and wane as needed. That space be created as needed to heal and intimacy be attracted as it fits the well-being of all. May we help each other heal. May we learn how to heal ourselves in our relationships. And may every soul contract we incarnate to heal. Be healed with every breath, known and unknown that we have the mercy that we are doing the best that we can in our relationships. Just that remembering we're doing the best that we can, that mercy to ourselves, that we can extend it to others, that everybody is doing the best that they can given their own level of understanding, their own level of awareness, their own past, their own pain, their own contracts, their own divine plan. May it all be blessed with the grace of mercy and the grace of piety that somewhere in there, there's a divine being just like me. And somewhere within that divine being just like me is me, the singularity, the quantum field the divine child that we all are as one at our core. That every interaction is already sacred and holy, but may we learn to play the game, enhancing our creativity regardless of the form of the relationship. Engaging our sexuality and our creativity that that divine flame may move through us in a way that brings more life, more passion, more creativity, more joy, more pleasure into the quantum field for the well-being of all through our own individual energy fields and beyond. May we have the most blessed and the most best, <laughs> the most best and the most blessed in bulk tide we have ever experienced on planet earth in bulk 2020 may this activity of blessing and light continue through every breath of every person <laughs> hearing this seeing this experiencing this whenever they watch it that we may be the blessings we are waiting for that we may bless all of life and that we may get our jam on for in bulk to thousand twenty and beyond for the well-being of all and so it is <laughs> wishing you all the very best and the very blessed they weren't kidding when they said we were going to have a good closing blessing on that one wishing you the very best and the very blessed if you are on the facebook live chat comment i will check them later if you're watching this later on the facebook live chat comment i will check it out later or tomorrow and if you are watching this on youtube please uh check the description uh, box below 
Uh, there's the link how to get to the Mark Angelo Lyons Mel for short uh, Facebook group. It's secret group. We do fun shit like this. Half of, more than half of it's gone, though. You won't see that unless you're in the group. Um, otherwise, just comment in the box below. Otherwise, wishing you all the very best and the very blessed of Ostara 2020. <laughs> Rebirth. Yay. Loving you all so much, but for now. Oh, my darlings. Hail, farewell, and blessed be.